Good evening, Jim Rocks. Welcome to Royal Oasis Spa for you educational tidbits. My name is Zenobia, licensed esthetician in Maryland, D.C. and Virginia areas. Come on and get in here and have a seat, honey. How y'all been doing today? I hope you're having a fantastic day. And if you're not having a fantastic day, sugar, then turn that ship around and don't stay stuck in that dry mental place, honey. That is a mental health tip for today. Now, I want you to be a gem, subscribe to my channel, and click the like button and feel free to leave us a comment on what you have taken away from this educational tidbit. And if you are new to my channel, I want to say thank you so much for tuning in and please take a tour of all the other educational videos uh, I have made. Lastly, take a ride on the Royal Railroad and roll on down to my website at royaloasisspa-gjc.com. Thank you all so much for tuning in, watching my video, clicking that share button, leaving me a comment. Thank you all so much. We had 106 subscribers and we're hoping to get to 200 by the end of the year. It's not, everything is possible. It is possible. But thank y'all so much. Y'all are so beautiful. So let's get into it. Skin scrubbers. That's what we're talking about today. Skin scrubbers and skin spatulas. So you might be asking, what is a skin scrubber, skin spatula, ultrasonic skin scrubber, or ultrasonic micro device? Well, I am here to tell you, so thank you so much for asking. You know what? Y'all always ask some great questions. You know, I really like the engagement. I love the conversation we're having because it makes so much easier for us to have a conversation when you ask questions. <laughs> so the skin scrubber in general is a form of gentle exfoliation. The ultrasonic metal spatulas are sound ways to create uh, vibrations to loosen, dislodge, and remove dead skin cells, sebum, and other type of debris. The same technology has been used in dentist offices to safely remove plaque from teeth. So this, all these different names that they have is all the same type of technology. They are just different names to describe the same technology. Uh, the ultrasound waves act on the body by stimulating cells. So the tiny massage it produces, it expands the space in which the cells exist. Now you may be asking, what makes the exfoliation tool any different from any other exfoliation tools and methods? Well, again, sugar, that's a great question. So there's a lot of skincare tools on the market today that can reach the same goal. So they have face scrubs, gloves, brushes, but I believe especially speaking from experience, these are too harsh for the skin, especially for those who have ultra sensitive skin type. That is me. You hear me say that on every video, I am sensitive. And I personally turn to the skin scrubber or skin spatula because it truly gets the job done without disrupting any of the skin barrier. And before I really get um, too far into this conversation that we're having about the skin scrubber, there is a difference between the skin scrubber and the ultrasonic skin scrubber. Yes. Yes, I am. I'm right there with you because I thought it was all the same too. So let me show you. The skin scrubber, this right here, it vibrates, but it doesn't use the ultrasound. So this is this is the only difference that I see. Y'all can put it in the comment section and tell me, you know, what is the other difference? So the skin scrubber uses manual vibrations with a rubber tip. Now here's the rubber tip. It comes with two rubber tips here. All right. So it relies on physical uh, vibrations to help exfoliate the skin and unclog the pores. Now, the ultra um, skin scrubber refers to a metal device that performs deep unclogging of the pores for effective skin cleansing. It delivers high frequency ultra uh, ultrasound waves and the waves are like the vibrations at 30,000 Hertz. So that is the rate, the current changes direction per second. So the one hertz is equal to one cycle per second. So I have the Z-Mid Sonosilk um, skin scrubber 
um, device and it performs four treatments. It extracts, it exfoliates, infuse, and rejuvenate. 28,000 vibrations per second to create this high speed oscillation. The Sono Silk has a built in port, let me show you, for water based for water-based product products. So we take off the, the protective lid. There you go. Hopefully you can see that, that, that water port. So the Sano Silk it sprays water during the treatment. So it allows the operator or allows the esthetician to keep the skin moist for the duration of the peeling step without having to stop to re-moist re the skin over and over. So you have constant skin hydration that leads to better exfoliation and rejuvenation results. So the Sano Silk also emits 430 nanometers. It also has a blue light when you turn it on, it has a blue LED light for the duration of the treatment, which helps acne prone skin, oily skin and inflammation skin. The Sano Silk performs all of its actions all at one time. And that's what I like. Um, the ultrasound vibrations, the spray mist that comes out right here underneath the blade and the blue LED light. And it also has three modes. It has a cleaning mode, it has the ultra mode, or you can call it the lifting mode, or the nutrition mode. Now, I'm going to put this down for a minute. The cleaning mode, see, you turn on, you turn it on. Well, let me get it back. You turn it on, click the button, and I'll, hopefully you can hear that. So that's, that's, a, that's the sound of the vibration. So you can feel the fast vibration and it doesn't cause any trauma to the skin at all so when you tip when you tip the skin i mean tip the device over can you see that mist see that mist yes so that's the mist that's coming from the device okay that's what i love about it so i'm gonna turn that off and we get to the next modes in a minute. So the ultra mode or the lifting mode, that's the for that's for extractions to remove the congestion from the pores. See how I told you when you turn it on, the blue LED light will come on. So also for the nutrition mode, the ticking sound. Let me let you listen to that. Listen. That's the ticking sound, and that is to penetrate serum into the skin. So when you use the nutrition uh, mode, I'm going to turn that off. When you use the nutrition mode, um, you're going to use the flat side right here. So you're going to use the flat side to penetrate the, um, the serum in deeper. So this, this is amazing. So this cell-to-cell -cell transformation is the scrubbing element of the skin scrubber. While the sound waves emits from the device, the process doesn't stop here. The ultrasonic scrubbing also slides over the skin. So let me show you. Let me show you with this one here. So it slides over the skin. So you just, you, well, with this one, you have to wet, wet the skin, but it just slides. It just slides over the skin, you can go across, you can pull up, you know, everything can go upward. That's what they prefer for it to go upward. And now when you go around the nose, you go down on the nose. Okay. So, um, so it, it slides across the skin and then it collects and cleans what has been sloughed off. Now, if you pay, if you pay close attention, you will see the oils and the debris coming out of the pores during the ultrasonic um, treatment. It's nasty, but it's nice, you know, because once you get that, you know, on your skin and you start to see all that congestion comes up, you know, it's going to work. You know, you pulling out something. So this one here is called, I can't pronounce it. It's G-U-G. G U G um, <laughs> skin scrubber. I can't pronounce it, but it comes with the two silicone um, bristle sleeves that I showed you. Yep. And then you can attach these right to the spatula. So I'm going to use purple because I like purple. Yeah, I like all colors, but I like the purple. So you just slide this sleeve right on. Okay, just like that. You slide that sleeve right on, and this spatula vibrates up to 24,000 times per second. So it does the same thing as the Z-Mits, but this one does not have the built-in water port um, like the Sano Silk. And you can see, you can see the difference here. You can see the difference. Got some water. You can see the difference. 
So this one has uh, four modes. It has the cleaning mode. It has the ion um, plus, the ion positive, and the ion negative, and it has the lifting. So the ion positive mode, that's for pushing in for the quick product penetration where the skin needs more hydration. And you can use this for about a good two minutes all over the face. For the ion uh, mode negative, that is for um, extraction. So that draws out all of the congestion. Now for the sleeves, once you cleanse your skin with a water-based cleanser, turn on the device to uh, cleaning. So I'm gonna do that. You hold it down, select the cleaning. Can you hear that? Maybe, maybe not. But we slip on the silicone sleeve, and this is optional. Y'all you, don't have to use the sleeve, but if you want to, it's there for your, for your desire if you want to use it. So, uh, you know, you can use it without the sleeve or you can't. But if you want to use it with the sleeve, they are both identical, okay? They are both identical on each side where I'm at, right here. Both identical, just different color, that's all. Double-sided, and you can alternate between using the wavy side, and you can use this on the larger side of the face, like here on, on the cheeks, or you can use the spiky side and use that around you know, the nose and the eyes. And it, it just helps to remove any debris that may have accumulated throughout the day. Now, for the ion positive, you can use your favorite toner and set it to ion plus. I keep saying ion plus, but it's ion positive. And you just hold the device upward. Hold the device upward and move, move it slowly along the skin, just like this. And what I like to do, you want to move, uh, you know, away from the face. You want everything wants to be outward, upward and outward at the same time. For the ion negative, this is the nutrition mode or the product um, optimization mode. Now you can apply an essence toner or you can apply um, a lotion or even a sheet mask when you're doing this step here. And then the lifting mode. So that kind of like, it's just like a beeping, okay, intermittent there. So it's like a massaging, uh, tightening, and contouring the skin. So you can pair that step up with an essence toner or a facial cream to keep the skin moisturized throughout the process. Now, although, let me turn this off. Just hold it down and it'll turn off, okay. So although there are many skin scrubbers on the market today, they they're also have the ones with the boosting additional features, just like the one I showed you here with the Sano Silk and, you know, the built-in water port. So, and some has the lifting effect or have the modes for skin moisturizing and other tasks. Now, the scrubber is, is a great treatment for those with sensitive skin or overreactive skin, rosacea-prone skin, and acne skin types. Now, how you use the, the skin scrubber, that's the part we're getting to if you don't know how to use it, especially if those using it at home. The skin scrubbers are water-based exfoliation devices. So in order for it to work, you, the skin must be wet, must be used while the skin is wet, which allows the ultrasonic vibrations to form and to build. So the skin has to be wet and you can wet the skin I have my little um, bowl of water here and my um, sponge. So you can wet the skin with, if y'all can see this, and if you can't, I'm sorry, because I can't see what you see. Um, so you can um, wet the skin with a sponge or you can wet the skin with a facial brush, okay? So we're going to do a demo on Z. Everybody meet Z. If y'all didn't meet Z in the last one, meet Z. Say hi, Z. She can't see her eyes are closed right now because she's trying to relax. So just leave her alone right now. Okay, you know, she, she's going to be nice to y'all, but she just relaxing right now. So at the beginning of your facial treatment, you want to take off the cleanser for a deep facial cleansing. So we're going to, I'm going to just do a quick step. We'll see my little mini brushes. Okay, so I just got some little peppermint cleanser in here on my facial um, brushes. And we're just going to cleanse Z skin real quick. 
just so I can show you how to take it off. So we're going to cleanse her skin with the facial brushes here. Okay. All right. So you can take um, your ultrasound, I mean, your Asano Silk Skin Scrub. I'm going to turn it on. All right. And you can use this to take off your, you know, enzyme. You can use it for extractions, for deeper penetration of a mask or serums. You can use the spatula for the best product penetration. So the skin scrubber, we're going to hold it at a 45 degree angle to the skin. And see that how that, that mist is coming out? And use the blade tip. The blade tip here pointed down for the deep cleansing and exfoliation. Now, the ultrasonic vibrations are applied to the skin to unclog pores, gently exfoliate dead skin cells, and debris to get rid of those harassing blackheads. So right now, you see the vapor flying out <laughs> or the mist from the blade, if you can see that, during the exfoliation mode. So this is the ultrasound waves emulsifying the water and other debris that is on the skin. So I'm going to show you. Now, we, put, we have the cleanser on Z's face, and now we're just going to take it off. So what I like to do when I take, it, take the product off, I like to have a 4x4 four four and wipe the blade off at the same time. Okay? So we're going into upward motion. And can you hear it? Now, that might be annoying to, to your client. They have that in their ear. And so you and on the forehead, we just going up, upward, just push upward. And you don't have to be aggressive. You don't have to apply a lot of pressure. Just be gentle, move slow, but keep the blade moving. You do not want to leave the blade on the skin. All right. So this is just for the demo purposes. And make sure, again, you always wipe the blade. And you will hold, tell her to tuck her lip in, and you will move upward on her chin. Just like that. Now, down for the nose, you will go down. I don't, I wouldn't go up. You go down. And then I like to use this little curve here and go around the nose. You will move the nose to the side and get around it. And do the same for the other side. Okay? And wipe the blade. Okay. All right. So that was my little demo there. So you will run that spatula along the skin using gentle pressure and put the scrubber along, put the scrub along your, the skin in an upward, like I showed you, upward and outward motion. So again, we was, if we start at the forehead, you start between the, you know, the brow and push up. And if you are extracting, then you go really slow, keep moving, but go really slow because you want to, um, you want the, well, the deeper, um, the slower you go, the deeper and more effective the spatula effects will be. So for product uh, penetration to the, to the skin, you will flip the blade over to flip the blade over so that the flat end of the blade is touching the skin. So if I had take, so if I took, you know, her uh, cleanser off and I put a safe and I toned and I put the serum on, then I will go across her skin like this, across Z skin like this. And then, you know, or you can go like this, like, like you're kind of massaging it in the vibrations of the blade is, is pushing it in. Yeah, but it just right here on the flat side. That's how that's when you you pushing in the product. So you don't need to apply any pressure, excuse me, while doing the treatment. And just simply glide the blade along the skin slowly and let the sound waves do the work for you. That's all you got to do. Even if you go up, just lay it on the skin. Lay it on the skin, go this way, lay it on the skin. Just slow. Now, what I don't want you to do, I don't want you to overuse the skin scrubber because I know y'all out there, you know, we've been, we've been, you know, linking up here lately and I know y'all will be so excited to see that oil and dirt lift off your skin. Y'all be like, mm, yeah, I'm getting it, but, but don't overuse it and don't be so aggressive, which can lead to injury to the skin. Remember, it's an exfoliation device, so I would not 
recommend using this every day of the week. You should try to use this like, I don't know, one, one to two times a week. You know, just like we don't like to use facial brushes and scrubs every day of the week. So you don't want to use this device every day of the week. Two, okay, so two to three times per week, maybe. And that, but that really gives you the opportunity to watch how your skin reacts. So let, so this lets you know if you can use it up to three times per week, or this is going to tell you if you need to lower it to one to two times per week. They always say less is more. So when it comes to extractions or it comes to exfoliating, less is more. And you also can talk to your dermatologist beforehand to get the best guidance for your skin and make sure you always follow the manufacturer instructions so you don't harm or cause any harm to your skin. And always remember, oh my goodness, to always clean your blade with alcohol or carbicide at the end of each use at the, between clients. Please y'all clean the blade because that is nasty if you don't clean this blade and you, you know, you go on from somebody else to somebody else. I clean it between every step. If I used, you know, used it now, I will clean it off with alcohol. If I got to use it again on her later, it's already been cleaned. So keep that blade clean. Um, and I always, again, use the four by four aesthetic gauze to remove any residue that's that's on the blade so nothing would be transferred and you know everything would be beneficial and healthy for for the skin. Now, you may be asking what are the benefits to using the skin uh, skin scrubber? Huh, <sighs> well the first one I would say pore cleansing, pore, pore. Pore cleansing, exfoliation and comedone extraction. With the pore cleansing the high frequency vibration or the sound uh, waves effectively, effectively open up clogged pores to remove dirt and grime. So it's given that deep cleansing feel. It shrinks the appearance of pores and it improves the texture and the tone. For the exfoliation, uh, the vibrations from the ultrasound skin scrubber help loosen those dead skin cells, allowing the skin to shed faster and allowing uh, the skin to be exfoliated. Uh, the comedones extraction, the open comedones, which are the blackheads um, that are also extracted during the process. So this is the benefit of using a skin scrubber. It does all of these things. You get a lot of benefit out of it. Um, what else? Um, contraindications. What are the contraindications? And that means, meaning what can be, what, what, what is preventing you from using the device? I feel like I can't talk today. <laughs> um, pregnancy or if you're breastfeeding, nursing, um, uh, pacemakers or electrical, uh, implants, circulation disorders, severe infection, cancer patients, diabetes, heart conditions, seizures. Absolutely never use it on dry skin. That don't feel good to nobody to use it on dry skin. Remember I said the skin always has to stay, be wet, has to be moist. And don't use over the eyes at all. Don't use if somebody has thyroid issues. Okay, um, what else can I say about this? Oh, so when I finish doing my cleansing, exfoliating, extracting, and all of that great stuff and penetrating, you know, my active serums. I always like to finish my facials with the Z-Mitz Glacier Hot and Cold Galvanic Therapy device. And I'm going to show you that. That's right here, right here. So it nourishes, it revitalizes, it hydrates. Um, the heat um, prepares the skin for the infusion and the cold therapy uh, hydrates and firms the skin. See, if you can see that, okay, you got three um, options there, and that's cleanse, nourish, and cool. So as well as the galvanic therapy to cleanse and nourish the skin, the heating element is used to open pores before cleansing and extraction. The galvanic is infusion for deep serum penetration. The cool cooling treatment um, is for skin toning. I like the skin toning, but she be cold. <laughs> she be real cold. So the cryotherapy helps to tone and lift the skin. It reduces um, skin redness. Now, what I do before I use um, this little cute device here, 
I use my conductive gel here. So I just apply, I'm not going to use my product on, on Z, but I will put it into my little bowl here, fan it out, and I will just, you know, cover her face with the conductive gel. And it makes the, the makes the, the, you know, the glide so much smoother when this metal, I hope y'all can see that because last time I looked at the video, I didn't even have it turned around right. But um, it makes this, um, the metal here go across the face so smoothly. It makes the glide really smooth and really easy for, and it's definitely easy for the client because they ain't got it, you know, be all stiff and, and, and stopping and all that. It's just a, a, a nice glide. You go in a circular motion all around the skin. It's like the perfect tool to add to your facial treatment room. And I, I just love it. So um, Z Mitts has some really great, you know, great products, great devices. Um, but that concludes my video for today. Thank y'all so much for watching. Um, I really hope that y'all enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully you learned something new from the video. Uh, please remember to click the like button and leave a comment. Click the subscribe button to help us to build our skincare community. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. If you have any questions, put it in the comment section. Um, you know, let's st let's stay together. Let's communicate with one another, and let's build this this esthetician uh, network together. Thank you so much. God bless, and have a great day.